<laughs> you can't make a mistake in front of this crowd, Michaela. Shh. Correct. Forty-six. Just a quick glance at the scoreboard. Fifty points to lead. The Black putting fifty-seven points in front with fifty-nine remaining. <gasps> well, would you believe it? Every time he gets near the winning line, and it can't be pressure, he takes his eye off the ball. Long way out. Pressure on this shot, but uh, it looks like he spotted a route in between pink and black. And he got enough side spin on, I think, also to play an excellent safety shot back. <laughs> Robert Milkins, maybe, I think for a minute he was going to attempt to play this as a pot safety. Chose the wiser option. Tempter for Ronnie O'Sullivan. Well, couldn't have been much closer. So a chance now for Robert. And he knocks his one in. Yeah. It's not an easy chance, this. To get his second frame on the scoreboard. Nice angle on the pink there, just to nudge one of the awkward reds into play. He's still got the one on the right-hand side of the table and the one along the top cushion, but... Seven. ..at least he's still in there with a chance. Eight. There'll be some one-table, one-visit clearance here. Awkward bridging. Odds against clearing up with both those reds 14. on the cushions, but it's not impossible. 15. These are tough shots particularly if you have to play them with any 20. pace, and he can't afford to miss this. Well... I think that was the old case of throwing your cue at it there. That was asking for the impossible. <laughs> Even Robert's laughing at that. You know what happened there? I've seen some shots, but that was a way out. This cue ball's close to the corner. Well, Robert Milkins for. Well, Robert Milkins is getting a bit of help to get back into this match. Okay, no alarm bells ringing at the moment. points the lead. He's looking for these two reds, two colours. Not tempted by the double that time. I think if Ronnie O'Sullivan plays the right, correct tactical shots, he's going to be home and dry it. But he's uh, he's got a difficult one, a risky, risky shot here. That was well played. Yeah, I think you picked up like I did, Steve. I just get the feeling that Robert Milkins has run his race here. The red he played along the top cushion, and the odds are getting that. 
Well, very long. And so just this red Eight. and a colour, and that will be the race run for Robert Milkins. Could have had easier draws in his debut here at the Masters. Still not quite sure what shot he played on that red on the top cushion. I suppose it's irrelevant now, but um, perhaps rolling it in may have been an option. 18. Yeah, I think he played it and he tried to play it with pace and cannon the other red off the side cushion, which is uh, all or nothing. And Ronnie had just missed a few. Oh, he's missed there, Ronnie but uh, it's enough. Robert Milkins' game just wasn't good enough. He knew he had to be his absolute best. Standing ovation for a rolling stone for Ronnie O'Sullivan, who goes through to the second round. Made a few mistakes, but still looked good early on. He runs our winner by six frames to one. Play will resume on this table.